the interreligious leaders of Kisumu have met here at Jumia Hotel, Kisumu, to deliberate on the possible ways through which the nation can come back to peace and cohesion after the general election. We convey our heartfelt condolences to the bereaved families. I pray for a quick recovery to those who have been injured, especially the six-month-old baby and a victim of police brutality who is currently fighting for her life at the Aga Khan Hospital in Kisumu. We are perturbed by the ongoing violence being meted out on defenseless citizens, especially women and children, by the security agents <clears throat> who are even breaking into people's houses and throwing tear gas, canisters, and shooting innocent and harmless Kenyans. We are concerned by the reports of the Acting Interior and Coordination Cabinet Secretary alleging that no Kenyans have been killed by the police. It is a reality from the report of the Kenya National Commission for Human Rights that more than 24 Kenyans have lost their lives.